3 months ago, I moved in with one of my friends I've known for a year and my sister into a 3 bedroom apartment. At first, everything seemed like it was going fine and my sister got along with him. Then one night a month ago, my sister came home with a guy and went to bed with him, and my friend was going insane. He first was complaining that he could hear her moaning, and it was gross. Then he started talking about how casual sex was nasty, and she was going to get a disease, and how he would never do it. Then he started criticizing her for how she dresses, cleavage, ass hanging out her shorts, etc., suggesting she dresses for sexual attention. I sensed a lot of anger from him, and thought he must be jealous. Then later the guy left, she had a shower, and came to hang out with us, at around midnight. The first thing my friend said to her was how was the bang? She said don't talk to me like that. After that, he started acting a little more normal, but I sensed some tension in the room. After that, the guy kept coming over regularly, and one night he asked her after another hookup followed by a shower how was it? She said the shower. It was nice. And she went to bed. Then last night, after I had come over again he asked her why, do you always shower, after spending time with your friend there? Do you feel dirty? She said physically, yes. Morally, no. Now if you keep acting like a pervert I'll have to make my brother choose between me and you. And remember I'm even the one paying more of the rent. He said oh my god. I just made a little joke. You're the one having loud sex with someone you don't even know. Your brother is probably traumatized from all the noise. I told him to stop saying sexual things to her and that she didn't deserve this abuse from him. He was just like alright, whatever. I talked to my sister in private afterwards and she seemed quite forgiving toward him. But I'm concerned by how things are going to go at this point. He seems to resent her for having a sex life with someone who's not him. TL. Doctor. He keeps trying to ask her about her sex life and she doesn't want to talk about it with him and tried to get him to stop. Can we make this situation work? FFS, don't let it get to the point where she has to force you to choose. Personally, I would make him leave now. I guess if you want it to work, flat out tell him, if he doesn't stop having inappropriate conversations with your sister going forward then he is out. End of story. If he tries to defend or talk about her social habits, walk away and tell him it is non-negotiable. I don't see him not continuing his, quite frankly, creepy behavior. Your friend has the hearts for your sister and was looking forward to some domestic time with her to prove what a good guy he was. Cut this guy out of your life. He's only going to get worse. Good guy. Nice guy. Good on you for recognizing this is toxic, unfair, and inappropriate treatment of your sister. You can't force your sister to talk to him about it or create boundaries on her behalf. What you can do is communicate with him about your boundaries and what happens if they are crossed. For example I expect my friends to treat my family with respect, kindness, and tolerance. If they don't do that, there are these consequences for our friendship. I think the entitlement he seems to feel toward her is terrible. Just how he thinks he has the right to get mad at a woman for who she sleeps with. He hasn't done much yet, but his attitude scares me. Has he ever showed any interest in her romantically? He kinda sounds like a bit of a backquote nice guy that's mad that she dared to sleep with someone other than him. Or he's just a plain old misogynist. Either way he needs to mind his business. Good on you for shutting him down. Bro you should not leave her alone with him. Kick him out. Yeah dude this amount of anger and jealousy flaring up the minute she shows interest in another guy is alarming. I had a very similar situation play out with a rumor to as my asterisk very best big bro buddy slash s after I broke up with a boyfriend until literally the day I went on a date with someone and then became so incredibly hostile he eventually forced me out of the house after trying to get me fired and destroying a bunch of my stuff. This scenario happened to me, a woman, I had two male roommates, one constantly accused me of sleeping with the other, I wasn't and, if I were it was none of his fucking business. He harassed me constantly. It escalated. He assaulted me. And I had to get a protective order, and go to court. It was traumatizing. This will escalate. I'm sorry that happened to you, and thank you for sharing. 
you are right, this person sounds dangerous and something will trigger him to escalate things, it's only a matter of what and when. Stick up for your sister, man. Why would you let your friend harass her like this? She doesn't deserve that, and you should cut this guy off for being such a jealous creep. I mean he did stick up for her. Op is alright, he is looking out for her. It isn't always easy to throw out a friend super fast, even if they are being inappropriate, because they're your friend, you wanna give benefit of the doubt. This dude got to go though, he just wants to f asterisk 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 ops sister. You, what a macho. I think you and your sister should sit him down and tell him to mind his own business and stop being so inappropriate. If he can back quote to accept that he needs to go asap. You and your sister need to find a new roommate and you should seriously reconsider your friendship with this guy. He's clearly a misogynistic asshole and a creep. Remember that you are the company you keep. Who what this guy is so gross. If someone was talking about my sister like that he'd be kicked out. Yeah time for a talk with this friend about how inappropriate and disrespectful he is being towards your sister. Heavy emphasis there. Let him know clearly that it stops now. Period. No ultimatums or threats. Just. It stops now. I agree with other comments suggesting a good lock for your sister's door. And maybe pepper spray to keep in her room too. Disagree on emphasizing the sister angle. It's gross to speak to anyone the way he's doing. And people deserve to be respected regardless of sibling status. Why are you letting this pervert sexually harass your sister? He wasn't making jokes. He thinks he is entitled to your sister's body because she is a walking vagina. This guy isn't your friend and cannot be trusted alone with your sister. If she doesn't have a lock on her door, get her one today. He goes before he decides her no doesn't matter. Just because your sister didn't bring him home to meet your roommate before having sex with him doesn't mean he's a total stranger. Even Marizo now that he's been around more. He's basically saying your sister is promiscuous, but she's only sleeping with one person and doing it consistently. Nonetheless, she could have a different guy over each week and it still wouldn't be any of his business. Set a firm boundary and make it clear to him whenever he says something that he should mind his business. Your sister is an adult and he doesn't have a right to judge her. I would talk to him and ask him why he thinks it's okay to talk to people he is not in a sexual relationship about their sex lives. And tell him that he has been acting in a very perverted manner and that your respect for him has really been slipping because you never thought of him as a cruel or disgusting person. But he has been really letting his morals slip lately. Harsh. But what he is doing is completely unacceptable. And he needs it pointed out to him that it is unethical and indecent. This is scary feels way too likely to escalate to take any chances. Yeah, try not to leave them alone until he's out. I'd be worried for her safety after talk like that. Honestly this is an assault waiting to happen. This friend of yours is a creep. He might just be a dude who needs some basic therapy, or he may be a predator, or something in between. Either way, this is a sign of something significantly wrong, and there is a good chance that your sister is not safe. I would look at your lease with your sister, and then work together with your landlord to kick the dude out. You'll lose the guy as a friend, but that's better than coming home to your sister being assaulted. This, really, I can't explain what hell it is to be sexually assaulted, and I don't wish anyone something like this to happen. That guy needs to go asap. I think it's time to switch in music your friend. He wants your sister. He's jealous as hell lol. Your friend sounds like a rapist. No normal man talks like that. If you care about your sister, kick him out before you regret it. Personally, I would never trust him alone in the house with her again. That obsessive and jealous behavior can easily escalate into him harming her. I would not take that risk with my little sister finding a new roommate may be the best solution. I think you already know the answer. Either he ceases to behave this way, or you kick him out. Plain and simple. I would keep an eye on him, and avoid leaving her alone with him too, because he sounds unhinged. He said oh my god. I just made a little joke. If he pulls a just jokes line again, lay into him. First of all, people usually shut up when the people around them don't find their jokes funny. 
Second of all, it's really apparent to you, your sister, and everyone reading this, just how desperate, jealous, controlling and petty he's being, none of which are attractive. I think it's probably time to look into getting a new roommate, or you and your C's moving elsewhere, if he keeps it up. Jealous, entitled men have often escalated to assault when they think they are owed a relationship slash six. At the very least try not to leave your sister home alone with him as much as possible. Your friend probably had a crush on your sister. Bet anything he also pulls a dude she's like a little sister to me. I'm just looking out for her. Card. It's one thing if he feels uncomfortable and expresses that in a respectful manner. But he's just being a complete douche about it. Almost like he is jealous. Your friend has told him that he's not a safe person around women. Believe him. Tell your sister that you're proud of her for standing up for herself. Discuss alternative living arrangements with her and what that will look like. For instance waiting out the lease and not renewing, subletting, end your friendship with him. You don't have to have a formal friendship breakup, but stop being warm and friendly, put him on an information diet, just be civil with him. Like a coworker you don't like. Your sister handles his comments well on her own, but you need to speak up when he's talking to just you. Make it clear that you aren't a safe person for him to be a misogynist around. You can say things like that's fucked up dude, or why would you say something like that, or what makes you think you have any say in someone else's sex life. You have a position of privilege. Use it. Use your voice, which he respects, because you're a man, to elevate women's voices. Be anti-sexist, anti-misogynist. Time to get a new roommate.